learn English. Enjoy English with our videos for the English. Hi everyone, welcome back to another lesson here at Forbes English. I'm Gabriella, and in today's lesson, you're guessing the meaning of a new expression. The expression is chock a block. But what does it mean? Let's take a look at some sample conversations using the expression chock a block. Sample conversation one. Person A says, You're late. Person B says, I know, I'm so sorry. The traffic was chock a block this morning. Sample conversation two. Person A says, How was your shopping trip? Person B says, The sales were good, but the city centre was chock a block. So, what does chock a block actually mean? Well, it means full of people or things. So, in sample conversation one, it's cars in this case. So, traffic meaning there were many cars on the road, and that's why person A was late. In sample conversation two, it was a shopping situation, and there were many people in the city centre. So, in that case, you could replace the phrase chock a block with many people in that case. Okay? But the, the main explanation for this is things or people, and in things, it's usually vehicles, usually cars in a city, for example. So, those are some typical examples of the expression chock a block. Let's practice this phrase together. So please repeat after me. Chock a block. Chock a block. Excellent. Now let's practice the conversations using this expression. I will be A and you will be B. So let's start with sample conversation one. Person A says, You're late. Okay, good. Sample conversation two. I'll be A again. How was your shopping trip? Excellent, good job. So next time a place is busy and it's full of something or people, you can say, well, it was chock a block. Good luck, everyone. I'm Gabriella. Thank you very much for watching. You're watching 4B English. Please like this video if you liked it, and remember to subscribe to our channel. See you next time.